because you're always talking all that talk now. Max all your credit cards. Think I don't know. Hundred hour work week and I'm just about to blow. Over on the keys, we have the lovely Sean Vince. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sean Ferris. I've been a professional musician in most of my life, since I was like a young teenager, composer, arranger, and performer. And I really thought it was a great opportunity to share some of the ex experience that I've, and the knowledge that I've gained over the years. I was pretty excited when they opened the school. We teach popular contemporary music which includes jazz, but other styles. And there are a lot of musicians out there that would love to learn more about music, uh, but aren't necessarily interested in the academic world of classical music. Being a teacher, instructor at this level, when you actually have to stop and think about what you do and pass that information on to other people, it's a good chance for reflection. It's made me grow as a performer and an arranger as a byproduct of having to reflect on, on what it is that I do and not just sort of just do it instinctually without thinking. It really makes you think about what you're doing, which is an opportunity always for a personal growth. You know, I'm inspired by the students that I'm teaching. My favorite moments are sharing information with a student that's here from India that is in, immersed in the Indian culture of music, fusing it with sort of what we do. So me learning from him, vice versa. The and advice I would give to students coming here is, number one, if you're interested in being a musician, if you've got that dream of being a musician or a composer or an arranger or working in any field like in the, in the music business, don't give up on that dream. At SOPA, we give you that opportunity to take your dream like to the next step. If you didn't fit in to that space where high school or even university puts you in their music programs, this is an opportunity for you to come to SOPA. It's, a, it's an invaluable experience. 